is up guys Sura here come back with a brand new episode of clash of clans so you might be uh, hearing some noises because it is raining outside and it is like a tsunami outside and also as you can see today i'll be telling you uh, like seven things that every noob does actually i'm not insulting any noobs right now uh, because everyone was a noob i was a noob too so, uh, so don't be triggered if i say so and i'm it is only for fun purpose so uh, subscribe me if you're new to this channel and like this video with that being said let's get started so the first thing is calling a lower player rush when you're rushed yourself so actually i have seen so many people that are like town hall 8 and they are actually rushed and when they see a town hall 6 that are nearly max they call them rushed because town hall 8 has more buildings but actually uh, rushed uh, rust actually they call them noob not rushed but Actually, the guy who is calling the other guy noob, that is the noob. That is the biggest noob, guys. I was, I was also a victim of that. Actually, I wasn't a Town Hall 8 rush. Uh, actually, I was a Town Hall 4. And somebody, like uh, there were two guys that called me rush because I was Town Hall 4. And uh, th those two were Town Hall 10 and Town Hall 8. So, actually, I hated them so much. So, if you do this, please stop this because that is so so mean guys so please do, don't do that in clash of class and if you do that you're a big noob and a rusher so if you want to recover your rush base then watch my video there you there will be a card in this video so you'll be able to go to that and also the second thing is the iron defense sorry sorry if my microphone is not sounding very well because it is broken and please uh, share this video so i'll be able to buy a new microphone guys and also actually what is iron defense because actually iron defenses are putting your buildings in the outside of the base as you can see in the image right now there are those buildings in the outside because most of the noobs think that they are a hot shit uh, they are a hot shit uh, putting your buildings in the edges because they don't think they are the people can deploy any troops in the uh, edges of that and most of the people actually fail attacking those type of iron defense bases because they also think that they can deploy any uh, troops in the edges of the base so that is a very big mistake guys and if you do just uh, replace your base with that and you will be able you will be become a pro very quickly and also the uh, fourth thing is actually the jam hack generators so i i was also a victim of that and i watched so many videos and went to so many websites and actually i tried to hack my account so much but it didn't happen because they were all fake guys uh, they said to download the app and when you download that app actually they get money but you are then you get clickbaited so don't do that guys that is a very big mistake and that is a very big problem for you because doing this type of things can clash of clans can hack you or sorry ban you so don't do this guys and also enjoy so this thing this this is a very important thing please share this thing also if you see any videos like this in youtube then report them because actually the, those are fake and don't uh, don't let that thing to happen and also the fifth thing is actually the players uh, that want to join a clan or create a clan and they say like i want to join a clan invite me i am the best best player of coc right now and when you actually go watch uh, go visit their base then you see that they are only town hall 3 and they don't even have the clan castle so don't do that guys and actually when i see those type of people i just love so much actually uh, I, uh, I i like to love so much i don't know why i love because um once i did it too but actually i got it covered at uh, very easily and also don't do that guys if they will just uh love at you so much actually every player in coc did did, did it once uh, once in their coc career so and also uh, one of the most stupidest thing is that uh, if you don't have the enough uh, capacity of the getting a troop like Pekka and uh, Pekka and Golem and you you still just request uh, like Pekka Golem or even a barbarian king so that is a very big thing guys and they will actually laugh at you so much so don't make uh, don't make others laugh at you and and be safe guys and also well, uh, the last thing is the not this is not the last thing and the other thing is that donating your uh, healers to the war clan castle so don't do that because that will make you fun of your own clan because healers won't do anything healers will uh, come outside of the clan castle and they will be like fuck shit and they would they won't do anything they will be uh, stopping like stupids and the other clan will just laugh at your clan so much so don't make uh, love at your la don't make love of your own clan and don't do that actually i find that so uh, actually i find that so much uh, what was that so much funny because i once did it too and actually i got kicked from that clan and 
the last thing that I'm gonna be showing you is actually a very funny thing and one of the most stupidest thing and actually every COC player did this in his career uh, when you realize that whoa this is not supercell this is supercell oh actually everyone will be like that uh, I was also like this when I realized that it's supercell and every COC player uh, just write it down guys i bet every coc player did this in his coc career so and i only had this six thing i think that was 16 uh, six things i if i if they are actually six things i will write six things guys six things that no player does in clash of clans guys so if you like the loot and also the, the facts that a noob does please like the video and you and subscribe me if you haven't already and also peace out